Hello, everyone. I am Chen Zhilong from Tsinghua University. On behalf of all authors, I am here to introduce our work, Understanding the Role of Intermediaries in Online Social E-Commerce, an exploratory study of Beidian. In recent years, an emerging form of social e-commerce leverages existing real-world social relationships to do marketing and has achieved great success quickly in China. In these platforms, intermediaries play a vital role. As shown in the figure, these intermediaries share item links and recommend items, bridging the supply end of social e-commerce platforms and the demand end of purchasers. They make these sites distinctive and shape the success of these platforms. Therefore, in this work, we seem to understand, firstly, what do intermediaries do in the emerging form of social e-commerce? And secondly, why do some intermediaries stand out in a crowd? To answer these questions, we conduct a mixed methods study. Quantitatively, we utilize the all-round data from Beidian, one of the leading social e-commerce platforms in China, for data-driven investigation. Qualitatively, we leverage the power of forum study and interview study to complement our data-driven approach, with a special focus on intermediaries' actions and strategies. In terms of the question that what intermediaries do, we find that, firstly, intermediaries recommend products as local trend detectors. Our data show that intermediaries' future recommendations positively correlate with their own past sales, as well as the past deals in their sales community. This is further corroborated by our qualitative study. Intermediaries recurrently promote items that sell well. Secondly, intermediaries serve customers as socially connected grocery stores. Intermediaries resemble convenience stores in the way that they promote products from diverse categories while not many deals are made per person on average. Our qualitative study tells us that intermediary sales target socially connected ones, and thus socially connected grocery stores are led to. We further investigated why some intermediaries stand out. We cluster intermediaries into groups based on their re-recommendation behaviors and correlate the clusters with their performances. We discover that intermediaries in cluster 4 are successful in customer number, deal number, and total sales volume. These intermediaries peak in a not long re-recommendation interval with heavy tails. Our qualitative study corroborates that successful intermediaries intentionally don't disturb potential customers much, while they focus their dedication whenever top sellers come. In terms of transaction modes, we discover significant differences between sales of successful intermediaries and the overall cases. These successful intermediaries broadcast their sales to a wider customer base, make more deals per customer, and sell products of more diverse kinds. The qualitative study shows that successful intermediaries admit that adopting the, the mode of low unit price, small profits, but quick turnovers is beneficial. This indicates that being small-scale generalists makes more successful socially connected grocery stores. Therefore, in this paper, we demonstrate the power of menu recommender system. People have more background information about potential customers and a better understanding of their interests and needs. Commodities are proactively pushed directly to potential customers, and these can make the recommendations more effective. What's more, a moderate amount and frequency for recommendation is important for the success of intermediaries, where promotion strategy resembling convenience stores would be an applicable option. Thanks for listening.